Hello to all and happy Hispanic Heritage Month. My name is Carol Garcia. I'm a member of NYSIT and I have been a teacher at Belport High School for eight years. I was born in Long Island, but my origins trace back to Central America as both of my parents are from Guatemala. I am very proud of my roots and cultural background as they have formed me into the individual that I am today. Like many others, my parents immigrated to the United States in the early 80s in search of a better life and opportunities. Hispanic Americans have contributed and will continue to impact the United States in various fields such as art, music, science, literature, entertainment, and many other areas. I think it is safe to say that we have not only contributed to this country, but we also represent this country as we currently are the largest ethnic minority, forming more than one sixth of the country's population. There are more than 50 million Hispanics living in all 50 states. It is quite interesting that Latinos many times do not see themselves as a single group, but we often identify more with our family's country of origin. Within this highly diverse group, there are people whose roots trace back to Mexico, Puerto Rico, Cuba, El Salvador, the Dominican Republic, Guatemala, Colombia, Honduras, and other parts of Central and South America, as well as the Caribbean and Spain. Hispanics may be recent immigrants or people whose families have been settled in the United States for generations. Most Hispanic Americans are U.S. citizens who were born in the United States. But one thing we all have in common is that we are proud of our heritage and also proud to be Americans. So no matter where you are from, all, always celebrate your heritage and be proud to share that with your family and anyone you meet. Feliz mes de la herencia hispana.